Thank you. You might be hearing the term net neutrality a lot more. It refers to the Internet we use today. Pro News 7's Janice Yu joins us with more on how there could be some big changes on the horizon. Janice? Lisa, only one person I talked to today knew what net neutrality meant. It's actually a term to describe the open Internet, which allows all of us equal access to websites. While a ruling by the Federal Court of Appeals could change all of that. Net neutrality. Not many of us are familiar with the term, but a ruling by the Federal Court of Appeals regarding this might change the Internet that we know now. As a small business owner, I mean, uh, if uh, we do everything off of QuickBooks, if there was a uh, change in the internet price, we already have slow internet where we come from. I mean, it would just pretty much knock us out of the water. Net neutrality is a set of rules approved by the Federal Communications Commission in 2010. It allows for the open internet we use today. The court ruling said the FCC does not have the right to enforce these rules. This means internet service providers can pick and choose access. They could charge websites and companies for fast internet, which means the consumer will pay more for the service. You know, if uh, we're going to have to pay more this for a little bit higher or the, the internet that we pay right now there's no way that us small business owners can keep on paying what what we pay the national cable and telecommunications association says the cable industry has always embraced the principles of an open internet and the court decision will not change that consumers have always been entitled to enjoy the legal web content of their choosing and they will continue to do so an open internet is good for our customers and good for our business at this point, there is no definite answer for what will happen from here. The FCC might attempt to rewrite the regulations or appeal the decision. Lisa, back to you. Janice, thank you. Amarillo